water. The pillow, the water, the pile of trash. The coffee cup. <laughs> Look at this light. Is it on? Yeah. Oh my gosh, what a radiant glow. Look, look at my eyes. I know. All right, can they hear us now? Yeah, yeah. Whatever you do, don't be fooled by how great yeah. they look. It's all lighting trickery. Here, let me see if you can see my bags. See? Hi, Hi guys. <laughs> welcome to our channel, or welcome back to our channel. And welcome to Bangkok. Madrona. Bangkok Madrona, totally. <laughs> I'm Erica. And I'm Dustin. And we are Bangkok Madrona. We're Bangkok Madrona. <laughs> no, we're Hitchcock for Madrona. For now we are. If you're new, welcome. We have a women's accessory store in the Madrona neighborhood of Seattle. We uh, design jewelry, we do fashion, we talk about business, we talk about adventures, we go on adventures. We're either in Billings, Montana, or Bangkok, Thailand. It's kind of that whole spectrum. That's what we like to do. Yeah. And I'm drinking a, a Red, Red Bull, Bull with a straw. Not sponsored. Dustin mm -hmm. should be sponsored by Red Bull. Oh, don't say that because I don't want people to think I'm a, I have a chemical addiction. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what? Like you always say, what's Wait. the difference? I yeah, know. I know. Isn't that? Did you see this? Well, the difference. Arika. Arika. A pretty good. She asked me if it was a C or a K. I thought that was good. But she didn't ask if it's an A or an E. Correct. Yeah. So yeah, what's the difference? Anyway, so we are going to film a haul video. We've been in Bangkok for four days. Um, did a little bit of business <laughs> and sure. a lot of shopping. Yeah. This is the land of the mall. Okay, and remember, we didn't know what we were getting into by coming here. We didn't have a plan. We didn't say we're gonna shop till we drop. We just happened to stay in Siam Square, which happens to be the epicenter of like six malls yeah. and it's like uh, one mall is the size of a regular mall six well, floors sorry. five yeah. floors yeah and there's like five or six of them high end from your dolce gabbana prada gucci balenciaga to market style mm -hmm. touristy and this interesting in between market really kind of cool yeah it's like almost like their local stuff mm -hmm. it's a little anthropology-ish yep. kind of earthy yeah some a little more avant-garde oh and then there's that mm -hmm. it's almost like um uh thai couturier yeah let's get started do you want to do me you sure me, you, you go first or me me you me me that's probably you. more yeah, do I the ratio. Do I start with like... I'm walking, minding my own business in the store, and Eric is looking at some jewelry, and I'm like, holy crap, Yeti, <laughs> Yeti Birkenstocks. I mean... They are what? amazing. And then I'm thinking, well, how do you walk with those? And I absolutely it's... love buying shoes I can't wear outside. <laughs> That's my thing. High fashion house slipper. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So... I mean, can you get a sense? I was so bummed. They're amazing. I, I wanted them, which yeah, you is did. bizarre. You did. I, I would never wear them, but I love the idea. It's like the reverse Gucci squirrel fur. Yeah. Slide. Yeah. These are on the front. This is a Muppet. And a hat. Next. Those have to be a applied <laughs> to appreciate. Totally. Okay. Totally. Mine. Okay, so Erica's like... Oh my gosh, those are so yeah. good. I'm like, where the heck am I going to wear those? Nylon brocade Adidas shorts. They're real, and they're long. I mean, what? They're long. I so mean, I'm like, buy those. Thanks for the gauchos. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to try and work them. I'm going to work this with an Indian kurta yeah. or shirt. One of those long, flowy linen ones. What are you going to add? The kurta. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and we're going to take this to a different Level. place. Yeah, we'll, we'll see if it works. Cheapy. Cheapy. What's this? Oh, this is so good. So, same mall that I got the free shoes. And it's it. what's funny is, is that the parrot uh, patch is puffy. Yeah, it's three-dimensional. It's like foam behind it or something. And the sweatshirt is like a neoprene. It's okay. really heavy and really good quality. Check out the parrot. It might be men's. Or cockatoo. Cockatoo? 
I don't know what they are. I don't know the difference. Bang cockatoo? Bang cockatoo. Hitchcockatoo. Two. Okay. <laughs> That's played. <laughs> We're mm -hmm. done. We're done with that. Okay. My... Oh, okay. This is... This is a Dustin moment. Yeah. But I'm walking through this department store and I go, Oh, look. Munsingwear. We haven't seen the little Munzingwear label in like 400 years. <laughs> the Munzing penguin. Munzingwear. See the little penguin? It's the opposite. I know, Camera it's stuff so, is so hard. hard. Anyway, basically it's penguin, but the original company that started penguin was called Munzingwear from Minnesota. This is from Minnesota? Well, the company, company. was, yeah. yeah. And it was really popular with golfers and the whole mid-century sort of. Uh, sports leisure like Thurston Howell would have worn nice. Munsing wear who's You're my, I, my style hero. icon. Yeah. Well, we'll, we won't digress. <laughs> anyway so I bought one and she goes you get another one and it's cheaper. Yes. So they totally upsold me. Just everything I pick is just oh my gosh. gonna be amazing. Oh is this the Burger King? Yeah. Little King scarf. Star. We got this is a really cool store. Hillside is the brand. Which is um, an American company. Well, I mean, it's sold in America. Is it yeah. American or English? I don't know. But what look did at. We determine? You guys, look at all the hilarious. It's like peanut butter, Brooklyn, burger. Cute little number. We had to travel halfway across the world to get our Americana on. Yeah. How ironic. Qualify this. I have been obsessed. Pre-Adam Levine, by the way. Ooh, I didn't know. Yes. Really? With the proper uh, Hawaiian, Hawaiian shirt. shirt. Now, Hawaiian shirts are all about the fabric. It's either good or it's horrendous. And then the vintage ones are either cost prohibitive for the really good ones or they don't fit. They were made for like skinny Elvis or something. <laughs> so anyway, I got... Skinny Elvis. Yeah. So I got one of in this big floral cute and then I bought one in this sort of hula did you tell him it was Ralph no that's so funny it's Ralph <laughs> you're like no <laughs> once again we crossed the globe to buy American products totally but anyway I have this Hawaiian shirt thing and when they're good they're good they're really I, good. I have to act I'm gonna do my favorite thing cuz I can't wait okay so so we're walking along and there's this like alleyway yeah. and this a garage. strange little setup. You guys. And we spot this like a UFO in the sky. Yeah. What? It's so wonderful. It yeah. It is so Not wonderful. Not to mention like a little anecdote is, is that this country yeah. Everything is referencing the Gucci, Gucci. collection. Yeah. I'm be beginning to believe the world is yeah. influenced by the Gucci idea. Everywhere. Patches. Dresses. And, yeah, quirky combinations. Little ribbon. bows. Yeah. yeah. I almost think this is a Perenza <laughs> influence. High layers and layers of, of fabric. polyester pleating. <laughs> um, and it's buttoned. Yeah. The... I don't know what to do with this, but there's got to be something, something funny neat. that can be done. Yeah. Like button them both there. And yeah. That's just that's hanging out. That's kind of cool. Anyway, it's like a little panel. panel. Super cute, really well priced, heavy, a lot of material. So I want to wear it with like a t shirt like this. Skirt. Erica skirt. I don't think these are exciting at all. Yeah, might not be. Okay, good. Pajama uh, pants. A pajama. Now that we said that, you just show A little it. lounger pant. Once again, a sexy I'm gonna, lounger. Yeah, I'm going to work it from bed to boardroom. <laughs> yes. Yes. Cocktail With, party. Totally. Just wear it. Throw on an Indian shirt in a flowy linen and just walk. Birkenstocks. Birkenstocks down the walk. I'm Mm -hmm. You have to buy something on because principle. it's so ugly. Yeah. So this is a... Don't be fooled. At first glance, it looks like a 1980s shaker knit sweater from the Limited <laughs> <laughs> that's gone through a garbage disposal. Because look <laughs> at the bottom. 
total slumdog millionaire. Yeah. And then... It's a skirt, It's you a guys. skirt. I'm going... So you wear with it... With arms. With these tied. Well, that was your trick. I think it's better. Designed. Yeah. It's outrageous. And then remember, you're like, I think it's a sweater. Yeah. So I, I think it's a top. I tried it on as a top, and it was... She fished her arms through there, and it gave her giant cowl. Yeah. It was well, bad. Fits me perfect, because it's elastic. Under $40. It's going to be an amazing statement, and it's so ugly. Yeah. Following the ugly sweater, I traveled... <coughs> 20 hours to get shop at Zara. An exaggerated yeah. Freddy Krueger. Because why not? In this color. Is small. I think I can wear this. Really? I don't think I will, I dare you. but I think I could. Okay, it's amazing. Such a great color. I had to. I had to. For that and nothing else. <laughs> like, and one of these shoes you're about to show. Yeah, show exactly. Them, show them, show them. Okay. I, I don't have enough, so yeah. Okay, what? Amazing. I called them Rags. <laughs> rag platforms. <laughs> <laughs> These, I think, have been used. The shoes at this place we were at are like, there was one of them, and I think they were runway or yeah. something. Yeah, they were used not that for the is, models. Yeah, not that this is like high, high fashion. Not that this was anywhere near Paris, Mil yeah. <laughs> Milan, New York, or Tokyo, but yeah. you know, the rag platform. They fit me perfect. They're dirty. <laughs> well, that's what you get when you make a sole out of white yeah. rubber. That's not going to last. Mew Mew-esque. Because they're only made for indoor. Of course. See, I don't I don't yeah. wear my shoes outside. That's right. Okay, okay next. Boy London. Yeah. So Erica and I round the corner and we're like, wait what? a minute. What? What's up with this? It's free with purchase. Yeah. That, that's what now. came with our purchase. So show them yours and then I'll show them mine. Well, I want to say first, I watched Atomic Blonde on the plane coming here and I became a little obsessed with Charlize in the role. So a few of my things are inspired by that. But when she came out in this t-shirt, cut up, Boy London, I was like, I'm buying that t-shirt. I'm going to find it right now. Right, and and then we saw it. It's nearly impossible to find in the U.S. Yes, yeah, never seen it in the U.S. So, so that logo. Olive green sweatshirt crew neck which oh. I will be stealing good because that'll fit me so the logo is either this words boy London or this totem with boy under it yeah so we got this the hat and then I got this last minute because I'm like that was rad I'm like wait a minute I'll actually wear, wear that, that. Here. do here. you get that it's a black hoodie so cute with the totem but then it has like a English, English royalty yeah. red sash. For real? Yeah, I'm sure I'm just insulting English people right <laughs> much. You know, a little vest with a side sash. You know that little vest they that they've wear? they've been wearing for 200 years. Yeah. So this is a pencil skirt. I have to wear the... We will do OOTDs. We've talked about that. We have to. Yeah. Boy London. It's knit. It's like a sweater. Well, no. It's like a sweatshirt. It's knit. Yeah. It's all that matters. Sexy. Dara. It gave me Golden Girls vibes, totally. you guys. LeMay like, for days. Like, don't light a cigarette next, next to this. <laughs> do It'll not. go up in flames. Do not. Yeah. Everything in Zara was on sale. Like, <laughs> 200 off. I saved $9. Well, that's pretty good, actually. Wait, what did I... Oh, I forgot those two crucial pieces. What? Anyway, keep going. Okay. Pants at Zara. They're so cute and great for travel. And we'll get to t-shirts, but I'm wearing my tomboy chain in the mixed short. I was um, influenced by, how did that get us? Oh, we the were pant. pulled into a store that had a fake Isamiyaki pant yeah. in the window, which didn't end up fitting. Um, but <laughs> but I, that's I another left, story, so we're not gonna talk about I that. I left with this number. It's rad. As you it's can so see. It's so cute. It's a Dustin shirt, but it's kind of has some flair. It's got some ethnicity to it. Yeah. And I think I can work this in India. This is going to be wonderful. This is my favorite thing you bought. Really? Yeah. 
more than the, the, the other, other one. one. Okay. I think this might be. So I bought two shirts at the same place. Here we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. The embroidery. Embroidered birds. Got it? Yeah. It's just an interesting combination. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this yeah. in America. Super cute. But I think I could wear these with some, like, 501s. Mm -hmm. And, you know, like a cowboy boot <laughs> and a bowler. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little something and a yeah. tie, a tie, yeah. an ascot. Oh, no limits. This is a dress. I absolutely love it. It's very flattering. When I see things like this, we were having this discussion, I'm like, I don't, like, if you're going to wear a house dress, you could wear that. That's so neat. That Just as much as some... Some Kmart version. <laughs> you're right. Some Walmart version. Kind of needed for the trip, but kind of always wanted this plastic. I wore them one day. They were the plastic burps, yeah. Six out of ten comfort level. And I bought some too. Yeah, he has some too. And you haven't worn yours. Not yet. You're because scared. it's too hot here and I want to wear the, the I will not wear these without socks. Yeah, your feet sweat and they rub. Which I'm sure just totally repelled most of the viewers. <laughs> they go, <"Bleh." laughs> Paul Smith Boutique. Mm -hmm. What a treat. Yeah. And I found these they're so cute. Numbers. They're they're like '70s Sesame Street. They're so vibes. thick, and they've got ribbing. And I'm telling you, these are going to be so good, slipped into a pair of Birkenstocks in India. Yeah. Not going to know what hit them. Yeah. And then I got these little sort of cotton cute. rag wool looking. Mm -hmm numbers we could turn these into a doll what are those little monkey? sock monkey sock monkey high-end sock monkey by paul smith okay second favorite thing i bought mm -hmm. oh. you guys obsessed obsessed Obsesticals. okay you think Shh. they're converse but the andy warhol brillo box which there's a documentary on actually there was one pair I left. It. They My were your si size. Well, don't lie. Half a size too big. But I bought well. inserts. <laughs> My feet look like a boat. But they're Andy Warhol Brillo box. And you know what? I actually think that the uh, they're Which Brillo bro, Brillo Bro balls. Yeah. I think that those are sold in the U.S. So. While he wasn't we, impressed. While we, He's like, I've seen those. I think my friend has Passos. some birds. Yeah. Another Atomic Blonde. Reference. Reference. Under $5. Oh my gosh. We went all over Everywhere. for four days straight. Those aren't the bright white ones. Yeah. I want those white ones now that I saw two days ago. So yeah. we go back go and back. the it's whole gone. market shut down. They were four seventy five. Yeah. They feel so awesome. So she paid, too, Try paid too much. Yeah. My credit card was declined. That's <laughs> 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 Why is that so funny? I mean, that's what you said in the other <laughs> hall. Remember what? the um, Tri Cities hall? Yeah. What? <laughs> I got some sunglasses and I was like, I put them on and I go, this is these were three ninety five or nine ninety five, and you go, her credit card was, it was declined. declined. <laughs> I just used your joke you on you, and I laughed at my own yeah. joke. This is a thumbnail. <laughs> They're not Mew Mew. Don't be these cool. are these are Gucci or Gucci. Gucci ripoffs. And these are, were super cheap. Yeah. Not as cheap as those other ones, but. Were these cheap though? Oh yeah. Under 10. Those are. It's kind of unisex. -y. Those are kind of good. Yes, we bandwagoned yeah. it. We jumped on the patch oh, bandwagon. Oh, the cool but thing these about these is they're pins. Yeah. So you aren't committed, or she isn't forcing me to sew these on something you yeah. know, at home. And this is slightly more artsy than like a bee. Well, that one is. Or a, yeah. These are a little... Gucci-esque. Yeah. But they're fun. We'll see if we use them. There's this company called... Bear Brick. Bear Brick, and it's Japanese, and they make... They're all over town. They're these all over. Three or four sizes of this bear thing, and they're collectibles. This size. There's a This size. Big, yeah. And this size. And we want... Them yeah. until we found out that the they price. were everywhere, but and the price. So I got me a little bit. A I'm little gonna put that on a bag, a handbag. Yeah, charm, charming. Oh my gosh! 
Okay. We found a really good t-shirt booth. This. Yeah. Three for fifteen dollars. There's nothing better than some Japanese writing. Yeah. And an owl. <laughs> this is the one I got. And a mustard. Yeah, Dustin got this but gray. They're good, right? Fun yeah. times. Fuchsia berry beret. This is a little chintzier than I thought it was going to be, to be honest. Pardon me, but what is the verdict on the... That's Arnold. You sound like Am Arnold. Am I being from Germany? <laughs> oh, they're going to just rip me apart in this... I know. In the comments. Right. <laughs> the two of the best things I bought. <clears throat> Again, top... Oh my gosh, these are... Top five. TDF. Yeah. What? A kilty flap, lace up sort of spectator, spectator. pump yep. resting Flat on form. a platform. And the what? red, white, blue. It's this is just me in a shoot. There was one pair, it was my size, these could not fit better, and it was thirty percent off. Reasonable. And they walked down the runway. Yeah. Reasonable but not <coughs> cheap. Well, those would cost a fortune I know. compared to what you paid. Yeah. Yeah. Normally. And extra extra. Read all about it. Wait a minute. Wait, upside down. No. Oh yeah. Clutch. Can't. It's got a texture uh, akin to a um Safiano? Yeah, I just exact. made that up. No, I that is no right. Is that right? So it's the Safiano fabric, also like the Epi leather by Louis Vuitton. We're just showing off now. That's like too much retail. <laughs> totally. Bye bye Bangkok. Hello India. Yeah, I'm so actually I'm dying. I know. To get there. You're excited. I'm excited. You're excited for India. Okay, so now we're gonna pack all this beep up and get on a flight from Bangkok to Jaipur, India, where we'll be for 10 days. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let us know what you like. I'm gonna do a daily fashion out yes. get up. In India. Yeah, the India get up for the day. Yeah. So a lot of this stuff will be incorporated into our... Into our India outfits. Yes. So yeah. Stay tuned. Thanks guys. Bye.